Well, it's been a few months, but finally, after all of this time, the MacBook Pro is ready to wipe. Finally. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Saturday. It's been a while. It has been too long, an embarrassing amount of time since I got the iMac and was like, I'm gonna finish getting the stuff off the laptop, blurb. This is me, that was in my impression of myself months ago. And um, I never did. And this is actually evidenced by the fact that if you've watched any of the vlogs in the past three months, uh, or longer, God, I don't know, uh, where I was shooting from this very specific angle, and you bothered to look at the laptop, you will know that uh, the screen didn't move. I had Final Cut open, I had pulled up Final Cut. I had a notification that was up in the corner. And then, and in the last few months, I had a pop-up from Flash Player that was like, Hey, you need to uninstall Flash. It's going to go away in December. I haven't touched the laptop. Once I got the iMac and I started moving things over um, enough to get started working, then I just worked. I just did what I needed to do. Now, I, I did clear off the external drive. All of the stuff that was on the external drive, I made sure that I had all of that backed up. But the stuff that was on the laptop proper, I never really did that. And that was okay, because I was able to work, and there was like maybe one or two times in the last few months where I was like, hmm, oh, I don't have this. It must still be on the laptop. I'll go get it. But then I got it, and I haven't gotten anything off of the laptop at all. I seriously have not touched it in two, three months. It's been a it's been a long time. So on the one hand, is that embarrassing? Yeah, it's it's pretty embarrassing because I had actually done vlogs where I was like, I just gotta do that and then I'll format it and it'll be all set. Boop boop -a -deep -a -doop. Again, making fun of myself. Um, but I, I put it off. I put it off. And it's, you know, there's no shortage of things to do around here. You know, I always have plenty to work on, but it always makes me feel bad whenever I put something off for practically forever. And I know why I did it. It's because the, the priority was so low. And it almost became just a part of the background in a way. But um, that, that day is over because tonight I told myself, I was like, you know what? I am going to sit down. I'm actually going to deal with this. Uh, so we didn't record any anything with Stephen and friends tonight. We just chatted. And while we were chatting, I went through the files on the laptop, and I finally did it. It is ready to wipe, which is what I'm going to do tomorrow. Um, I'm going to format it, install uh, Big Sur, and then it will be formatted. Now it's, you know, we got another whole journey with it because... Um, Ultimately, it really needs to be sent in because the battery inside has swelled and the laptop doesn't close. But before I do that, uh, that actually might be the computer that's going to run Stepmania. And now your wheels are turning. You're like, wait a minute. The thing that spurred you to do this was the fact that you want to use Stepmania and, and play DDR. And you know what? Yes, it can be a powerful motivator. <laughs> and it was. And that is, yes, that's the reason probably that I, I did this tonight. But then also because it's become an eyesore. I really, I'm ready to, to finish that up. The other reason, actually, is there's kind of a multi, there's a lot of reasons all, all together, is that uh, at the end of every year, I take all of the files that we made that year and I put them onto externals. I never did that in 2019. I have all of the files still on my computer from 2019. They're like in multiple places, so it's not th there's not a risk of, of data loss, but I haven't put them onto drives and stored them. Now 2020 is over, so I have two years worth of stuff on the drives, and I haven't done that, and I was like, okay, all of these problems of mine are converging, and it's time that I deal with them, so that's why I was, I was dealing with it tonight. Yeah. So tomorrow... My plan is to put Big Sur on a USB drive, put it on the computer, format it, install it, put Stepmania on it, or whatever it's called on... Is it called Stepmania on the Mac? Whatever. 
get that working because that would be exciting and fun. And then also start the process towards working towards collecting all of the 2019 files. They're mostly in one place, but they are a little tiny bit scattered. And then start putting those onto external drives. Yeah. Hey, that's not the only thing that happened today. Tonight um, was also the first day of Sumo, because we're doing Fantasy Sumo again. So uh, I'm just, I'm not going to tell you who everyone's picks were, because it's it's a lot, but I'll tell you who my picks were. Uh, I went with Takanosho, uh, Shima Noomi, Tochi Notion, and uh, Sato Noomi, and that was a good uh, team, because no one lost tonight. I am the only person? Yes, I am the only person in our group to have a perfect score the first night. So I have eight points. And does that mean I'll win the whole thing? No, there's still 14 more days, but it, it bodes well. So I'm crossing my fingers pretty hardcore that uh, things continue to look good. So, yeah. As I've done for previous Fantasy Sumo tournaments, I'll probably just update you guys at the end, and that'll be two weeks from today. Yeah, because there's 15 days. Okay, that's it. That's that's it. I'm very tired. Um, it is very, very late. I need to get some sleep. Tomorrow is our day off. Uh, and, like, I'll be dealing with this, but, you know, it's, it's fine. Um, last week and the week before, we watched movies. We've been watching movies on Sundays. And I told Mao, I was like, if you pick a movie, because in my opinion, it's her turn, because I picked Die Hard. I said, if you pick a movie, we'll watch it. And she said, okay. She hasn't told me what the movie is, or if she actually really has one picked out, but there is a chance we'll watch a movie tomorrow, and I'm stoked. I'm really looking forward to it. Thanks for watching, and as always, let's meet back tomorrow, shall we?